Hey everybody, Sherry Piles here for the Teresa Collins Design Team and I wanted to share with you a creative project that I made using the new memorabilia line. It has a lot of uh, chalkboard pages and it's very fun and very motivational. So the project that I made today is just something that you can put in your home as like home decor as a motivational piece using um, the entire collection of the 12 by 12 papers and all of the embellishments. So in theory what this album does, it sits up on its side so you can look at it as a book. So it also is very, um, it has a lot of motion to it. You can move back and forth. And it's just really a lot of fun. Now for CHA purposes, I have not adhered this to the bottom because I wanted to, number one, show you how I created this. And for traveling purposes, I'm going to wait until I get to the show to adhere it in. So um, my base is just a seven gypsies drawer that I painted white and then added the memorabilia tag from the bottom of the papers like this onto that. So what I did was I measured the bottom of my box and just on a plain piece of white cardstock I measured out however many pages I wanted, and this is one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten pages. So there's 20 when you include front and back. But what I did was I measured on the opposite side 10 inch, I did it in inch, um, inch increments. So I measured and I drew a line every inch or so for each page. And then what I did was I took a piece of white card stock and then adhered a piece of washi tape from the collection a quarter inch up on the white card stock and then the remaining um, onto the white piece of paper. And that enables you to have a flip page. So then I did the same thing on the other side and I continued that process throughout the whole book. Now there were gaps, so when I started the project, what I did was I just started at one end and then I lined up my next piece of washi tape and then overlapped because of the patterns on this, they, they match up. And then um, when you abut them next to each other, you might have to overlay them just a little bit and then I added the next one for the next page. So for each page, I did that continuing throughout the whole entire album. So these pages, each one is connected simply using washi tape. And then I um, cut each of the 12 by 12 papers because I really loved all the papers and I wanted to see them all. So I took the pieces that I liked the most if there were decorative um, items on the paper or designs on the paper like this one says recorded always and forever so I made sure I cut that out to put on to the page and that overlaps just a little bit of that um, quarter inch allowance over the top of that washi tape so it gives it that extra um, sturdiness that it that it needs because it will be opened and closed several times and a lot of use. so I wanted to share with you that is how I created the the, this uh, unique book. It's really more of a display piece. And then um, I really liked the washi tape that had the uh, typewriter type font inside and there's words, some dictionary words like memory and time. So I just put that over the top of each one on each, in between each of the um, pages and I just felt like it helped tie it all together and really gave it a uniform look because each page is so different than the other but I really enjoyed working with this and creating with it and um, 
So I'm going to go slow throughout each of the pages so you can see them and I can share it with you. Um, these are the new uh, sequins from the collection and they are so much fun to play with and you can layer them. You can even add like enamel dots to the centers of them. I just wanted to keep them plain and simple because I just, I just love the, the look of them. And then um, layered stickers, those are also really fun and new to the collection and chipboard elements and I just layered them um, a lot of the pieces in here with white plain white cardstock and then corner rounded um, a lot of the pieces and again more layering love love these um, layered stickers they're, they're just so much fun and then more glitter border strips so I just cut that down and added that here and then some journal cards love and then decorated the banner from one of the sheets of paper. And I love this this paper. It's like chalkboard. It's It's got a fun feel and look to it. Really, really enjoy it. This here's a pocket. So the Adore, I just took the Adore um, die cut and put it on a pop pop dot or you know, foam tape for my pocket. And it just fits in there just perfectly. I really love that. Again, another pocket here. And then that's one of the new stamps. I love this. Uh, and it's just like the front where it says recorded always and forever. It's just in miniature size. And I just um, stamped it with black ink over one of the embellishments um, journal cards from, from one of the 12 by 12 papers that I cut apart. Really fun. And then this is um, a banner from the button set. Really like those two. And this hello um, is also a stamp. And I just stamped it. This is a chipboard piece from the chipboard elements that I stamped on there. And then layers. I am really, really big into layers right now. So this is a frame from the die cuts. And then I added one of the layered stickers right into the center of the frame. I just really like the look of it. And I love all of the depth that there is on this page. And then sentiments. There are so many motivational sen sentiments. This one, I haven't a clue how my story will end, but that's all right. When you set out on a journey and the night covers the road, that's when you discover the stars. I just, I love all the sentiments. Again, another layered sticker. This is one of the journal cards that I cut out and I just put a, this sticker that says fly on um, pop dots. It's just so much fun. Again, one of the journal cards added the glitter border strip and then another layered sticker over the top using pop dots the whole way just tons of layers just love this this book just makes me <laughs> makes me smile just so much fun lots of pop dots lots of layers I think that everything looks so good you know layered with um, the white cardstock behind it. it makes everything really pop and defines what it is you're sharing in your books and I love this uh, journey hot air balloon so anyway I hope you are inspired to create something fun and unique and I hope you learned something new today thank you so much